The golden boy of the golf world is facing felony charges. Scotty Scheffler's rough morning was broadcast for the world to see. Right now, he's going to jail. Okay. Okay. He's going to jail, and, and, and it ain't nothing you can do about it. Period. Um, when I was sitting in like the, the holding cell or whatever, I was there was a TV there and I could see myself on the TV on ESPN. Police arrested Scheffler at the scene of a deadly crash in Louisville, which was on the route to the PGA golf course. He was not involved in the crash, but police say he disobeyed orders to stop his car and accelerated forward, dragging an officer to the ground. But Scheffler says this was all just a chaotic misunderstanding. And he was released from jail within a few hours and still was able to play in the tournament. And actually, he did better today than he did yesterday. Well, the Night Beach Justin Case joins us now live in studio. Justin, if any of us were facing a felony for assaulting an officer or allegedly assaulting a police officer, there's probably no chance that we would get out of jail the same day. Well, we took that exact question to a local attorney, and the response we got is that none of us would get out of jail within three hours. That attorney told me that at a minimum, we would spend the night in jail before having our first appearance in front of a judge and getting bail. Go to jail, and, and it ain't nothing you can do about it. The way Friday started for Scotty Scheffler, he'd probably rather forget. Scotty Scheffler. But the way it ended was remarkable. Just hours after getting arrested, booked into jail, and being released from jail, Scotty Scheffler shot a five under 66, putting himself in contention going into the weekend. I'd probably do really bad. Do you think you could shoot five under on the best day of your life? There's not a chance I could. The, I've shot even par here once. My head's still spinning. I, I, I can't really explain what happened this morning. Um, I did spend some time stretching in a jail cell. That was a first for me. People are shocked he was only in jail for less than three hours after facing a felony charge for assaulting an officer. Being an ex-law enforcement person, I couldn't believe he was out of jail in two and a half hours. We asked an attorney, could any of us be released from jail as quickly as Scheffler? Scott Goldberg does not think so. When you've been charged with two misdemeanors and a felony, and the felony is a, a battery on a police officer, you don't get out of jail the same day. There's absolutely no possible way that you would ever see that, at least in this jurisdiction, let alone in three hours. There had to be some very important people making some phone calls, or there had to be some uh, circumstances when they looked at the arrest that this is not a good look. Uh, let's get past the first day, but let's get him out of our jail. So Scheffler's attorney says Scotty was instructed to go around the rack and he says the charges will be dropped or they will go to trial because they are not interested in any sort of settlement negotiations. He said Scheffler did nothing wrong. Back to you. Hi, right, Justin. Thanks. And the Louisville Police Department has not issued an official statement on the situation or released the body camera video. Of course, we'll be on the lookout for that. Meantime, tomorrow and this weekend, you can watch the PGA Championship right here on Wink.